inventions. No matter where you are in the world, the opportunity to chat with others who have the same interests as you, buy some cool memorabilia and meet some of the stars that you've enjoyed watching on the screen or hearing as you've played a fun game can be one of the greatest experiences you'll have all year. But they can also be daunting and hectic. Even after years of attending events, I still find myself the night before, even the morning before I leave, frantically checking over and over again that I have everything packed that I need. So I thought it would be a good idea to do a video highlighting some tips of, for attending conventions. 1. Take a change of clothes and deodorant. This either sounds stupid or obvious, but humans have this pesky habit of radiating heat. Pack a couple thousand into a hall, all milling about, sweating and sharing their heat, and you have a stink fest. Now, I have no sense of smell, so I'm just basing how bad that notion is on what others have told me, but I can attest to how nice it is to change into some fresh, dry clothes every couple hours. Trust me, you'll thank me later. Two, wear comfortable footwear. Be prepared for a long day and a lot of walking. Not only are these events held in large halls, or in the case of this year's London Film and Comic Con, two halls, but you will also be walking back and forth between areas countless times. I'm disabled and have to take public transport, so my need for comfy shoes may be different. But ladies, practicality before fashion. Those ridiculously high heels will not get you far. Three, buy a display book. For those getting autographs and, or photos, these could be lifesavers to keep your special memories protected and flat. You can buy them online or even at shops like Tesco or Wilkinson's. Some say that certain types of sleeves in the books can scratch and damage the ink on signed items. But I've stored mine in the cheap Polly Pocket style books for years and they've never had any negative effect on my autographs. Another suggestion, if you are collecting autographs, keep the display book in your bag and carry an A4 plastic storage box. This way, as you go from table to table, you can just put your signed goods inside and then properly slip them into the wallets later on, thus cutting down on some kerfuffle in time. Even if you have no plans on getting any autographs, etc., these can come in handy, especially for taking number four on our list. Four. Print out a list of who you would like to meet and your schedule for the day. As with everything on this list, the type of convention you're attending can affect the variation of what you need. But more than likely you are going to need a schedule of events, talks, photo shoots, etc. for the day. Clearly highlight all that you're attending so that in the madness of the day you can easily spot what you need to at a glance. Personally, I usually print two copies, one to keep folded in my pocket for easy access and one in my display book for backup. Writing up a list of who you want to meet will help make sure you don't miss anybody. I usually cross people off throughout the day so that I don't get confused. And will also help. 5. Budget. These events can be expensive, ridiculously so. And it's very easy to say, oh I'll just buy it, it doesn't cost much. But before you know it, you haven't only spent everything in your bank account or maxed out your credit card, but you've put yourself in a lot of debt. Set limits and be prepared to make some sacrifices. If you're focused on getting autographs, prioritise. The people that mean the most to you should be the ones you aim to meet first. If you're buying merchandise, browse the stores first to get an idea of what you want to buy and budget from there. 6. Pack snacks and plenty of drink and be sure to keep hydrated throughout the day. As I said earlier, you'll be sweating lots. Don't forget to replace those lost fluids. Plain and simple, really. And finally, 7. Don't forget to fully charge your phone, camera and whatever other gadgets the night before and don't forget to pack spare batteries. 
trust me i've been to too many of these things and had my camera die on me don't make the same mistake at the end of the day the key things you need to a quadruple check you have are tickets money and drink everything else is pretty much personal choice extras that can help i always pack a backpack try not to have to carry too much unless you're cosplaying just really be sensible i hope these tips have helped and no matter what event you end up going to i hope that you have an awesome time for now though this is sketch signing out